Hi guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to my channel. We have a very, very exciting video today. Ohio now has Korean fried cheese. You guys know I would only ever get these in LA because I didn't have one nearby. So I'm now an hour away from a location called Mochi Nut. So I got two Korean fried cheeses. I got this cool coffee boba drink which it's in the cutest little can I've never had boba so can't wait for that and then i also got some donuts for later which the cutest packaging ever am i right so in here i got oreo tiramisu and the sprinkle donut so i got a regular original one which i just put ketchup on it and I wanted to put mustard on it too, but I cannot get the packet open. I need to like keep little scissors in my car because I always struggle with that. And then I got this um, spicy chili sauce. They had a spicy honey, but they were sold out of it, which I don't know how. It's only 12, they opened at 11, but it was busy. It was very busy in there. And then here's a barbecue sauce. So I got those sauces. And then the other one I got is the Flaming Hot Cheetos one, and it's all mozzarella, so you could do like half hot dog, all mozzarella, all hot dog, which I love mozzarella, so I did both all cheese. And then they also had like a ramen noodle one, the potato one, but I had to get these. Okay, we are going to take a bite of the Flaming Hot Cheetos one first, and also pose for the thumbnail, so this might look a little goofy. Mmm. Wow. It's actually spicy. Woo! I feel like lots of the time when you get a flaming hot Cheeto, like mozzarella sticks or anything like that, the flaming hot flavor and the spice like wears off. Mmm. <laughs> that is so good. Mmm. I've never had the Flaming Hot Cheeto one before. Mmm. So, this place opened up in August of last year, and then I just never got around to coming here. It's like an hour and 10 minutes away. I don't usually come up to this area that often, but there's like an outdoor shopping outlet that has like a bunch of outlet stores, which, you know, has all the deals. So I think I'm gonna stop over there. It finally stopped raining. It's been raining seriously for like two weeks straight in Ohio. It's crazy. So let's try this. I am not sure what boba tastes like. Is it what ube is? Ubi, ube? I keep seeing that flavor at Trader Joe's. I also had an ube donut, and I think that's what these balls are, but I don't know what it is. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of afraid. Mmm. Okay, first off, this coffee drink is so good. Mmm, it's good. I don't really know what I'm eating. <laughs> They're like chewy, chewy fruit snacks or something. That's what it tastes like. Mmm, I like that. It's kind of fun with like the chewy balls in it. Mmm. Okay, now let's try the original. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Original is way more crispy. That's good. And let's try this spicy chili sauce. Mmm, that smells really good. I'm so happy to have this place. The drive is so worth it. So I'm gonna go do a little shopping at the outlet. I'll probably vlog it too on my second channel and then I'll go home because I don't like leaving my dogs more than like four hours, four or five hours. I just feel so bad. And I used the Rover app and I had a babysitter come this past weekend because I went out with my friends. So I had someone come stop in for an hour and just play with them. Mm. 
So that worked good, but every time I leave the house, I set a timer on my phone, a stopwatch, and so I know how long it's been. So it's probably been like an hour and a half now, and I don't know if there's like any other things I could do up here. I know I'm right by Lake Erie, so I was like, maybe I'll go stop and see the water. I had you guys ask me some questions too, so we're gonna answer some of those. I really wish I could get this mustard open. I love mustard. I got one more. Let me try and see if this packet is easier. Ugh. Watch it just like squirt everywhere. Come on, mustard. Why are you so hard to open? <laughs> Come on. I can't get it. Anyways, first question. Would you ever get a third pet? Yeah, I would love another pet. I am such an animal lover. Like, I would love another one. I want a guinea pig. Mm. I would love a guinea pig. Two of them. I'm, like, thinking about it. Ugh, they're a lot of work. They actually are. You have to feed them fresh veggies all the time and stuff. I had one, and then, like, cleaning the cage is not fun at all. Um, but they're just so cute. Like, guinea pig ASMR. I love hearing them chew because I used to have one, and it was fuzzy was the best ever. So I would love a guinea pig, but I just don't know. I love my two girls at home. I feel like we're a perfect little family. Mm. Do you sometimes feel guilty after eating? What are you doing to keep skinny? No, I do not feel guilty because it's all about balance. Like if I'm going to be, it's not like I'm eating five of these and then I'm going to have like McDonald's later for dinner. Um, I'm still eating like a normal amount of food that should be eaten during the day. And I home cook meals every time I'm really not filming. I mean, I do go out to eat with my friends a lot too. Like my friends are big foodies too and love going out to dinner like weekly. But it's normal to eat and it's all about balance. Just you can eat out also eat at home eat when you're hungry and don't keep eating when you're full it's all about balance and no one should feel guilty about it and get your exercise and your sleep drink your water and yeah which I try to only really drink water I don't really drink like sodas and stuff but I like coffee really sugary sweet coffee <laughs> If you could eat only mayo or hot sauce for the rest of your life, which would you choose? You guys know me, I love mayo, but I love hot sauce, which speaking of, I totally forgot. I got hot sauce too. Got a little Frank's hot. I really like hot sauce and spicy things. It just adds a lot of flavor. I think I'd maybe want hot sauce. Don't tell me I won't be able to open this one, too. These packets are always so hard. Like, there's no... Oh, got this one. Okay. Yay. How do you deal with hate comments? I love you and your videos. I love you, too. And, you know, hate comments are everywhere. Everyone gets them if you are online. It's terrible. People are mean. But I just, like, think that those people doing that are... Weird, so weird. 
they have like an obsession with you to keep watching every video you do and every move you make in life they have an obsession with you and they need to get help themselves because they are not happy so they bring it out on other people that's how you have to think about it because the only people talking bad about you are the people that are behind you and want to be like you because they're behind you looking at you following you and talking shit I also have negative comments like on a block list so the people that leave a negative comment will be auto blocked forever so I don't even like let them but I mean I still see I still see them and it's just like I have never once left a mean comment <laughs> I just think that's so bizarre. So, you, you only have haters if you're doing good, so. Just let them, let them be weird. <laughs> Do you ever get sick of eating out? No, honestly, I love eating out. Like, if you mean, like, physically sick? No. Not really, because whenever I'm full, I stop eating in my videos. Um... But I love going out to eat. It's just such an experience and such a fun time, like to go out and get food. And I have like the DoorDash pass. I love DoorDashing food. I do like eating out. I like cooking at home too. Cooking, I think, is very fun. But I just love it. It's so fun to go out and get an appetizer and get different meals all the time and dessert like I don't know it's just fun I like it more for like the experience too, like hanging out with friends and just like going out it's something to do especially in Ohio when there's not much to do but like go to restaurants the movie theaters and bars like there's not like too much to do here but to go out and like spend money and go shopping Mm, this one's good. It's a lot more soggy But it has really good flavor I'm Having a good hair day today Mochi and Hershey would love another sister or brother. They told me to write that <laughs> that's so funny a third dog for me I don't know I wouldn't really be able to walk three dogs to put three dogs in the car like to take them to the park would be such a pain I don't know I, I would love a Doberman one day or even another Frenchie because they are like such cute dogs um I don't know right now I don't think so unless it's like a fish <laughs> I want fish I would love a big aquarium with big fish in it. Um, I think they're just so pretty to watch. And like, you can get like exotic, really pretty fish. I might get a fish tank. Or a guinea pig cage. <laughs> Are you going to Cedar Point this year? I live in Michigan, I went to meet you. Um, to be honest, as I've gotten older and like even just this past year, I am like really scared of things like that. Like, I'm just scared. Like, I cherish life and like there's accidents sometimes on rides. So it just like scares me. Like to think about it that way. Um... I don't know. I went last Halloween and I had a lot of fun, but the rides just scare me. Like I'm scared. I'm terrified every time I'm like going up the hill. And that's like the point, isn't it? Like adrenaline, but I don't know. It just scares me.
sorry I was getting scared someone was like walking up to my car and their car they were like also right next to me on the highway for a while and then we both got off the highway at the same time and both pulled into the same plaza which I was like I'm being followed so I was just like watching out but he went to the car next to me and he's like talking to the girl you gotta watch out and always know what's going on in your surroundings <laughs> Sadly. Do you ever live or do you ever feel lonely living on your own? No, I love it. I really do love it. I am on just like my own routine and I've been so used to just being alone and I'm like always filming or always editing. Like my schedule's like odd but no I like the quiet I'm the type of person to enjoy like I like going shopping by myself like I'm content doing a lot of things by myself and then I can go hang out with my friends and then like just go back home and like a recharge of my energy I need like alone time So, I couldn't really imagine having a roommate. I don't, I don't think I would like it. Um, I'd rather just like hang out with my friends and then go back home and be like in the quiet. I don't know. How are you liking your extensions? I love them. I really do. They've been so easy to take care of. when I had them um, the first time I had three rows of hair and it was just very thick and I kind of want to try one of the donuts I'm just gonna like take a few bites because I am really full but I want to try it and it was something sweet Woohoo! I'm so happy I came here I've been wanting to come here so long but anyways I have two two rows of hair. You really can't even like see it, but it's just two thin rows of the hair. When I had it the first time, the rows were so thick, and there was three rows. It was like so heavy. I was like walking, and my hair was weighing me down. But it's been so easy to take care of. I wash my hair every Friday, so it's nice and fresh for the weekend. And I feel like maybe it's better for like my natural hair too since I'm like not washing it as often I feel like I don't put as much heat on it because like my real hair is like right here like I'm like more focusing on like curling the bottom um I don't know I'm just trying to get my hair like healthier but I love the long hair I am loving it I kind of want to just try original these are so cute oh my gosh I love it so you can rip it off into little balls Oh, it like doesn't taste like a donut. What is that? Look, I made it smaller. <laughs> I'll try Oreo too. It kind of just tastes like a funnel cake, like funnel cake dough. This is fun to eat though. I like how it's like that in balls. Your thoughts on this year's Met Gala? Who dressed the best? I think Sydney Sweeney did. I think that's her last name. She looked gorgeous. And then also Kylie. I think Kylie Jenner looked really good. Some of the outfits were so weird. But I feel like maybe that, like that's kind of the point. Like it's like fashion. Doja Cat scares me. <laughs> like how she dressed with the cat face makeup. That kind of scares me. But I mean, she has Doja Cat. <laughs> how do you get stared? Do you get stared at off women? Do you get star? Do you get stared at off women? How do you handle it as I get dirty stares and I hate it? Do I get stared at by women? Um, if someone stares at me, I just growl at them. <sighs> No, but really, I just kind of like, just don't look at them. <laughs> I don't know. You can feel the stairs. If, I don't, I don't, 
Women, not really. I mean, maybe men, guys. If a guy is staring at me at a gas station or something, I will stare back. Um, if it's a, a girl, though, I don't, I don't care. You know, you know, if people are staring at you. It's because they think you're pretty, or they like your outfit, and they're just like looking at it. Um, if a creepy man is staring though, and like won't, won't turn away, that's annoying. Like when you stare back and they like are still staring and then you look away and you look back and they're still staring at that point I stare back and I'm like like a mean look because it's like guys don't like just take a glance they're like like ew and the last question that I had saved is your thoughts on the tart trip drama to be honest I don't even know what that's about I have like I say so out of like internet drama and stuff just because like I don't know I don't really care <laughs> except I did like see all about the Selena drama and Hailey Bieber drama and all of that which I do love Selena Gomez I've always loved Selena Gomez you guys know my old music videos back in the day of me singing all the Selena Gomez songs but like also like poor Hailey because everyone's just like Imagine dating someone, marrying someone, and then like all over the internet. Everyone's video needs to be done now. Not on my purse. <laughs> That's the second time I've spilled coffee in my passenger seat. Ugh. It's the center console. I blame it. It opens up randomly and then it spills. <laughs> I need my table. Oh no. So this is my favorite little like sack that I keep in my car that has like everything in it. And I have a little Tide stick, but I feel like this stain's a little bit big for a Tide stick. Well, maybe I could just like throw it in the washer when I get home. I had it sitting out because I used my lotion, which always comes in handy. And this is the cutest little bag ever. I have it in my storefront and I just love it. But now I got it all stained. I'm sure I could wash it though, so I'll just worry about that I guess when I get home in like a couple hours. But like I was saying, like imagine just like someone always hating on you on, oh wait, I have to clean my purse. Like I was saying though, like imagine like marrying someone and then just people like constantly like bringing up your ex, ex or your husband's ex. I don't know, I guess it gets annoying. They probably don't even care. Like maybe they don't even like, <laughs> read about any of it probably not they're probably like you guys are crazy <laughs> and even if he's not happy like who cares it's like not anyone else's relationship like if he really doesn't like her or something it's no one else's relationship like if he if he wanted to get like a divorce or whatever like that's up to them you know so who knows i don't know about the tart drama though i love tart makeup but i don't know well, hopefully the, the purse is clean. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That was delicious. I will definitely, most definitely be coming back there and getting another with that coffee too. I'm really glad I like that because I was wanting a coffee for the drive up here since it's like a little longer of a drive. But then I looked at the menu ahead of time and I wanted this, but I just didn't know if it would be like too coffee tasting or what, but it's super sweet very good but thank you all so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and i will see you all in the next video bye guys